What's going on, everybody? I'm just sitting here getting eaten by d -Lo. Not really. But I figured I'd have a little add-on to... Look, there's Capro. Maybe it'll come over here and eat on me. Snakes, spiders, everything. Best life in the swamp. What can you do? I wasn't sitting on this moose chops, he'd be running away. Okay, well, as I was saying, before I was rudely interrupted by everything here. Gonna have a little add-on video to my kibble slash moose chops video. Because, you know, uh, one of the ingredients, or a couple of the ingredients in kibble are rare flowers and rare mushrooms. And... I showed John the moose chops that you can up those harvesting levels, you know, their successful harvest rate, how much they weigh, and all that kind of shit on the moose chops when you level it up under the harvesting levels. But I didn't tell you where to get the shit. Well, these whole spindly leg trees right here, when you harvest them with the moose chops, see, there are 25 rare, rare mushrooms. All right, and the cattails. You know these some bitches here. If you don't know what a cattail is, these will give you rare flowers. So just bring your friendly neighborhood moose chops down here to the swamp. You also get. You know, plant species X seeds, which are pretty nice, but they're not hard to find anyway. So you bring them down to the swamp, and you harvest up a bunch of cattails and a bunch of these damn trees. You don't have to do it very often. Because you'll get a fairly significant quantity. Yeah, I just saved the narco berries and those. Fucking dump the rest. You know, you're not here for that. You can just eat your way through the trees here. They get wooden thatch as well, as you've seen. But that's as simple as just dumping the shit out. Ain't no biggie. There's Sarko. Do we want to kill it? Well, whether we wanted to or not, we did. All right. Save the narco berries. Save the rare shit. Dump the rest. See, those will get you a little bit of rare flowers, some spindly shits. These things here. All these ugly plants. See, you get some out of them too. So. Yeah, I think we're good. I mean, we got a couple hundred of each. But that's what we were in the process of doing, is we're making up some kibble. I'm going to go get some honey with the bear again. And we're just about to where we can make the extraordinary kibble. Yeah, I think it's extraordinary. Extraordinary, exceptional. Anyway, the best kibble, the teal shit. We're, we're about there. Matter of fact, I think we are there. We just needed some more shit. And right now I need some more honey. So I'm going to go over here and get that. And then I'm going to make me some kibble. And then I'm going to go out hunting again. Because that's kind of what I do. And we'll bring y'all back. How's this for bullshit? Our beehives are gone. I only harvested them that once. And now they're gone. I didn't dino wipe. I didn't do any of that shit. They're supposed to be here. 
That fucking sucks. Like, a lot. Now I got no viable source for honey. Unless I build a platform up to that one right there. Because, it, you see, they're all over like this. There's no fucking way to get them. Unless you're really quick and you fly up here and then you dismount and you can collect it on your way down. You know, go ahead and take the fucking beating. That burns my ass. I don't know why they went away. They don't time out. I've never seen them time out. Unless my ramp allowed something to get up in there and attack it, but I've never seen anything do it. And the area is not active if I'm not in it. I don't know, our Thyla's back on that tree. That's how you get a Thyla out of the tree. showing your bird a little bit. Easier to shoot it, though. Man, it makes me mad. Okay, well, looks like we fucking look for other options, or I just go make a bunch of shit and fucking harvest another one. I, don't, I haven't seen any on the ground. Maybe one or two, but I don't know where they're at. So much for that plan. I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna drop off the rare mushrooms and rare flowers. Finish making the yellow kibble out of it. I guess I'll just keep a dire bear in my pocket. And if I see a hive on the ground when I'm out hunting, I'll just harvest it. And throw it on my bird. That was a good idea that just didn't fucking work out in the end, I guess. I don't know. I don't know why. Can't tell you. I wish I could. We'll see y'all after a while. Alright, so we tried something different this time. And we're just going to try to do it this way. I've heard as possible. Never really done it. So, we built this big ramp up here to this beehive. I've already harvested it once. Not gonna risk waiting around for it to fucking despawn again. So I built this big house around it. <clears throat> well, little house, little big box. I'm mm. gonna we'll go up here and see if I can attack it with a dire bear inside that box and then place this door real quick and trap that queen bee in there. Okay. I don't know if it's in there or not. But it says there was wreckage. So. Maybe. Maybe. 
Then all we have to do is presumably go out of render range and then come back and that queen bee shouldn't be mad at us anymore. We should be able to feed it. I got a handful of kibble. Hey, there's this an alpha rex to kill. While we're waiting. It's out of render range anyway. Let's go ahead and kill this thing real quick. Well, as quick as any alpha rex dies. Good looking Rex. Wish I could tame it. It should make some alpha tame kibble. That would be awesome. If you want to spend the resources to fucking knock one out and tame it, then make some special kibble for it, that would be wicked. You have whole army of alphas. This one's taking a fat minute to kill. Alright, let's go check on the progress of our mean bee fiasco. There's our tree. It's all dark and shit right here. Mm. We don't want to do that. Huh. Oh well. Well, that shit didn't work. Because there ain't no queen bee in here. Oh, come back here. I don't know where you went, but come here. Alright, let's just tear this shit up. It's worth a shot. Something interesting going on, I'll let you know. Well, here we are. Not that it's going to help us out much. But. I did manage to shoot the Quetzal from the ground. And the only way that worked is it's a level fucking six. That's the only way that worked. Because I only had to shoot it once. And it went 9 night. 
tried jumping on my, off my bird and landing on his back. That didn't work out. But this may at least. Here, you ain't getting no kibble, you level six piece of shit. Really? Hesperonis is fucking aggroing? Look, it's gonna gain a whopping three levels, so we're gonna have a level nine. If we don't have enough weight to carry a fucking dire bear, I'm killing it. Because it may solve the the honey problem. Because I'll just fly that motherfucker. I'll build a platform saddle. And I'll fly that motherfucker through the redwoods with a goddamn dire bear on his back. Here, have some prime meat, you piece of shit. Where'd my mouse go? There we are. Why am I fucking floating backwards? What is going on with my controls? That was stupid. Anyway, what kind of weight we got? 832 right now? Alright, so it'll live. I'll take it back to base. We'll level it up a shit ton. And throw it all into weight. And health and, ma and stamina. Put a platform saddle on that son of a bitch. Yeah. It may actually work. We don't need much of a Quetzal. But we do need a Quetzal. Well. Don't really need one. But I am going to work. On. Coming up with a method to get. A better one. Like I said, I just happened to stand there. That one was close enough to the ground I could shoot it. And so I was like, yeah, what the fuck? I'll try it. And it actually worked out. Who'd have thought it? My son said that's that's how he gets his. But I ain't never had one that was a one-shot. You know, the only way that's going to work is if it's one-shot. Because then the motherfuckers are just going to fly off fucking screaming. Looking behind them like, oh, no. Oh, no. And then you can't do shit with them. Except fly around behind it. Hoping that you can... Fucking... Hit it again. Get an opportunity to hit it again. Where's my goddamn dire bear? Right there. All right, we're loading up on the honey that we can reach from the ground. That's what we're doing. And it may make a goddamn S plus beehive. They fuck them giant bees. Call me a cheater if you want to. I don't give a damn. It's a pain in the ass. I mean, it's doable. You can run around and keep doing it this way. I mean, I've built three platforms already and harvested honey off of the fucking trees. I mean, you already seen me do it. It just pisses me off that that other one fucking just got 86 for no fucking reason whatsoever. So, yeah, I don't know if I if I if I require a lot of honey, which I don't think I'm gonna need much more. Because I'm only going to make so much kibble out of it. And I've already got a bunch of sweet cake. And I already got my ovuses, so I don't have any reason to have a whole bunch more sweet cake. I'm not taming any fucking snails. Because I'm not going to stand there and pick up their fucking smegma. Just not going to do it. There is... And... Like, fuck all to tame. I ain't shitting you. I mean, you'd know it if I did, because... They'll always bring it back for them. But I have not seen... Dick. These woods over here are pretty, though. I really like these woods. 
What level are you? Fucking level 24. You're a turd. Look, right there. Fucking level 48. Fucking, I don't abide level 48. These delos are coming to get some. All right, well, I'm going to keep looking. I'll see y'all later. Hey, there's level 150 Pel Pelagornis. I've already shot it once, but it didn't go Ninite. Can I see it hanging from his ass? There, now it went Ninite. Right in time for a D-Lo to spit in my face. Look, there's another one coming up. Gonna get some. Fucking think so, retard. Alright, where did Pelagornis fall? Alright, it fell right there. It's no big deal. I like Pelagornis. You can land in the water with him. And I think that's cool. 150 is, like, good. It ought to be able to carry me in a few levels. Ooh, a Gallimimus blueprint. And a glass jar blueprint. That's fucking garbage. prime meat left on me. I'm not using kibble on a 150 Pelagornis. It'll get prime meat. I'm packing a bunch of meat. <laughs> yes, yes indeed I am. Hey, it's not prime meat. Maybe it's prime fish meat. Alright, maybe I'm using kibble. If it'll eat the purple. Yeah. It ate the purple. It ate the purple and fucking liked it. Alright, what kind of stats we got? Yeah, 282 weight. Shit stamina. Shit health. Yeah. Whatever. It'll get better. And it's Pelagornis. I can land on the water. Use it as a jet ski. You can fish off of their back, too. It counts as a chair. You know, you gotta have a chair in the water to fish. Yeah, you can fish off the back of a Pelagornis. It works. You also aggro everything in the water. So if you want to build, like, a fucking taming pen for Megalodons or something... And kite it over using the Pelagornis, and you can do that. Of course, the 150 had to be the, like the ugly gray motherfucker, but that's okay. Up in level 12, Sarko. Level 54, there's Enosaur. And level respawn. Falco was coming over to save the fucking crazy bitch. Well, I think that was a male. That was a mean bastard. Falco was coming to his rescue. Nature bonding at its best. It would be nice to find a female trike. I swore I seen a trike over here earlier. This red fucker running from us, only a level 60. All 
There's Carno. Anyway, back on the hunt, y'all. Hey, you want to do something just because we can? Or try to do something just because we can? If we're going to have a low-level piece of shit Quetzal, why don't we have an imprinted low-level piece of shit Quetzal? Because there's another level 6 right there. And it's a male. Our other one's a female. I'm going to try to, like, bail off my bird and... hit a parachute and see if I can shoot that fucker. If I can see him. Where's he at? And there he's out. Hey, that actually fucking worked out. And he just laying on the ground over there by that crazy bitch. These straps are fucking annoying. Airshoot straps. But hey, guess what? That shit just fucking worked. <laughs> That's awesome. First time I've ever used a parachute. Levels that fucking Terry. Fucking 48. Jesus Christ. You get so sick of that crap. All I need is one high level female. Just one. Level 129. I don't know. Oh, piss off, dude. Hey, aloes. There's a trike. I don't know if I can peel these other bastards off without killing them. One decent one. Nope, I didn't hit it. It's toast. I need to stop fucking this bleeding slow shit though so I can fucking kill them. Before they get over there to my fucking awesome ass Quetzal. <laughs> oh, really? Not that it's gonna hurt his fucking tame and effectiveness a lot. Delos. Fucking Delos. Probably not gonna gain any levels, but who gives a shit? We're like breeding a level 8 and a level 6. Yay. Yeah, it didn't gain any levels, but like I said, who gives a damn? We're just gonna breed them. And then I'm just gonna fucking stick a knife in them. It's gonna be awesome. They're gonna be a fucking happy couple living together forever. Till they have a baby. I don't know what low level thing this is. Well, look, my Argent Trap's still here. I haven't had any use to use it, but it's still here. Okay, back on the prowl. At least we eliminated two fucking level six Quetzals. He said another one's not going to spawn until you get rid of them. So, I got rid of them the fucking way I get rid of shit. Put it in my pocket. Kill it later. I'm not going to be able to record the whole thing because the baby's awake, but right there is a 180 male fairy. 
That's a max level mean bastard. And I'm going to make sure he comes home with me. Stand up here on this rock and shoot him till he runs away. You know the story. I can't find a fucking female at all. I don't know what the problem is. But I'm probably going to tame this up and then head back to the house. I bet it's been flying circles around the redwoods looking for a fucking thylacolio. Because I was wrong the other day. I thought I had a mate and pair and I don't. I got two females. So I got to try to find a male there. So wish me luck. Hope y'all have a good day.